Hi, this is Thomas at Shoreline Aquatics. I wanted to show you guys today the group of F1 San Felipe Altum Angelfish. They're coming for sale next week. As you can see, they're completely hyper, completely hungry. These are clean, tank-ready fish. Let's talk about how to care for these. In the wild, Altum Angelfish they come from soft, acidic water. I found that tank bread fish are much more adaptable. What they do need is clean water with low pollution and low bacteria load. I'd recommend cleaning your mechanical filters several times per month, and I also recommend large weekly water changes. Altums are social animals that like to live in groups of five or more fish. My stocking rate is about seven fish per 100 gallons. In these tanks, I change the water about 70% weekly. For comfort of the fish so they don't panic, I typically change as low as the fish are tall. If you already have large altums, mixing these small ones in is no problem. I notice the big fish tend to leave them alone and the smaller ones are quick to eat first and they're gonna be big in no time. Tank bred Altum angelfish can grow to adult size in about a year. I find that 82 Fahrenheit is the sweet spot for keeping Altum angelfish. Keeping them in warmer water, let's just say if you're keeping them with discus, they're going to do great. They can be maintained in temperatures upwards of 90 degrees. They're also adaptable for short periods of time for cold water, such as getting cold water changes. But for long-term maintenance, 82 degrees or higher is better. Clean food. I can't stress the importance of clean food. I have these fish right now eating VitaComplete fish food, and they love it. I get great results from that food here. There's an original formula and a color formula. I would suggest the color formula if you're also keeping fishes with red colors. Both formulas contain astaxanthin, which promotes red color, but it's also an important antioxidant that keeps your fish super healthy. Right now, I'm mixing the two formulas together, so whichever you choose, the fish are accustomed to eating both varieties. I'd recommend feeding your fish two to three times a day. Another food that I like to give every once in a while is spirulina-enriched brine shrimp. You can get this at your local fish store the fish are accustomed to eating it and they love it. So if you guys have tried to take care of wild Altum angelfish unsuccessfully, then I suggest that you guys try these. These are completely healthy tank bred fish that with your care you can enjoy for years. These fish will come for sale on January 13th and they will start shipping out the next week, January 20th, weather pending. Thank you guys for all your support throughout the years.